So I'm Megan Smits. I'm the manager of volunteer services at Urban Ministries. Um, it's Urban Ministries of Wake County that I'm representing. Um, we obviously are in Wake County. We are located in Raleigh, close to downtown Raleigh. Um, and our organization has three main programs that we that we do. Our one of our big programs is our open door clinic. So we are a healthcare facility that serves individuals who do not have insurance. We have a full, um, a full clinic, including a pharmacy that our patients receive medicines for. Our second big program is our food pantry. Our food pantry serves our neighbors who are in need of food. And then our third big program is our women's shelter. We have the Helen Wright for Women's Center, and that is an emergency shelter for single women. We have several different volunteer opportunities. We employ about 50 employees and we have over 1,100 volunteers. So we really rely on volunteers and we have lots of opportunities to become involved. Some of our in-person opportunities that we are currently recruiting for is our front desk greeter. This position sits in the front lobby and opens the door to our patients that are here for their clinic appointments. This is a, it, it's a really great opportunity because you're face-to-face -face with the public. Um, also, we have opportunities in our food pantry. Our food pantry is open Monday through Thursday and the shifts are in the morning. Right now, because of COVID, we're running a curbside pickup pantry. And so the volunteers are involved in packing boxes and getting groceries together to bring out to the cars. We, in our clinic, we have several opportunities. One of our most popular opportunity is the intake triage volunteer position. For this position, you need to have an EMTB or higher, an RN or um, you know, other upper licenses. And then one of our best ways to volunteer in our clinic is to become an intern. Right now we are under underway on our fall semester, but for spring in October, we will begin to accept applications for our spring semester. This is a great opportunity um, to volunteer in our in our in our clinic. It really is great for a lot of pre-med students, um, students that have that interest in pharmacy, or we have a scribe internship, we have healthcare quality internship, we have patient assistance clinic assistant. So we have a lot of um, intern positions within the clinic. We also have intern positions in the other departments as well, but our clinic is our highly sought after place. As far as remote volunteer opportunities, we definitely have those as well. Our most needed one are medical interpreters, and this is for Spanish English um, interpreting. So this is remote because the majority of our doctor visits right now are telehealth. And so if you, after you go through the training, if you um, are able to interpret, then you would just call in from your phone at home. We also love food drives. We can't really survive without them. So if you're interested in organizing a food drive with one of your clubs or dorms or neighborhoods, um, that definitely counts as volunteer hours. And then care kits is another opportunity that you source the materials, assemble some kits, and then donate them to us as well. We do have an outdoor opportunity and it's our landscaping opportunity. We call it Dirty Deeds. Um, and it's light landscaping. It's fun for people ages eight and over. It's outside, we rake, we leaf blow, we mow the lawn. We trim the bushes. It's very um, light landscaping duties. In order to become involved with us, all you need to do is go to our website, urbanmin.org, and fill out a volunteer application. And then we will be in communication with you of getting your certifications and adding you to the schedule.